Dramatic spike in the maternal death rate in the United States tops our health lead today. An alarming new report from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention shows the number of women who died due to pregnancy or childbirth complications rose significantly in 2021. And the death rate among black women is twice as high as that of white women. Here to discuss is Dr. Megan Ranney, she's the Deputy Dean of Public Health at Brown University. Thanks so much for being here. So the maternal death rate in the U.S. has been a problem for decades. Why is it still an issue today? Well, the decades of issues reflect so many of the things that you and I have discussed. The inequitable access to health care. We see higher rates of materna maternal mortality in states that have not expanded Medicaid access. It's about lack of pre- and postpartum care. So many women fail to show up for visits to an obstetrician in that first or second trimester, don't get care until it's too late to address many of those preventable causes of maternal mortality. And then, of course, there is structural racism. We know that chronic stress plays a role not just in setting up black women for all the things that raise rates of maternal mortality, like high blood pressure or asthma, but also are related to their care in the healthcare system. There's story after story about woman, uh, women who are well-educated, high income. Um, there was even a woman who worked at the CDC on maternal mortality, black woman, was unable to advocate and get herself the proper care and died in the postpartum period. So it's this combination of factors that continue to put the U.S. far behind our peer countries um, among industrialized nations.